Hey guys, in this video, we'll be learning how to draw a custom wardrobe sliding door. Alright, let's get started. Okay, so we'll be using the wardrobe customize function. So click into your wardrobe. Next thing we want to do is put in a frame. Okay, so we just quickly drag a frame out. Alright, now we would like to resize our frame. So for the width, I'm going to resize it to 3000 and for the height 2400 we can immediately generate just right click to generate a sliding door all right so I'm going to pick the general normal sliding door which is this all right so just choose and let it generate Alright, once it's done generating, right now as I can see, I have two sliding doors. So if let's say I would like to add another one more door, I can just click the plus. Okay, so right now I can see three different doors. Alright, next thing we want to do is to create a hole on all of this panel. Alright, so we can click into the board selection mode, right click and use the panel point editing function. Alright can use the drill hole function all right so we start by drawing a rectangle all right so from here to here okay over here as i can see i have already created a hole in my 3d all right so let's continue continue drawing a rectangle just like that all right, next thing we want to do is we can always resize okay we can always resize according and over here 500 all right so once we are done with the sizing of the hole we can actually just click onto the rectangle and use the array button Alright, so I'm going to array horizontally, okay, and put in negative 50 for my interval. Alright, once it's done, I can just click save and then return. Alright, so as you can see right now, the frame has been created. Okay, next thing, we're going to continue right on the second panel. Alright, so same thing, panel point editing. Okay, so now we are going to use the drill hole to create. Alright, same thing, we can just click onto the rectangle and always do our size. Okay, so over here 1500. Okay, so 1517. Alright, once it's done, same thing, we can just click onto the rectangle and array. So, same quantity, put 3 and the interval, I'm going to put negative 50. Okay, so over here, 3 holes are created. Okay, so this one, we can just delete. Alright, so I'm going to use this, the same frame, so I can just control V to copy all right next thing I want to do is click onto the frame and move it 1960 to the right okay and also I would like to rotate this frame all right so the this the longer side should be on the right hand side okay we can use this to rotate 180 degrees okay next thing we want to do move it so 2960 to my right Alright, so as you can see, the frame of the sliding door has been created. Alright, so now we would like to create the doors. Alright, so which means that we are going to put a panel at the back of the frame. So we can always use a super board. Okay, so just drag your super board out. So what you need to do is to change the height. Alright, 2240 for the height. Okay, and then for the width. I'm going to make it 20 and for the depth 900 and 20 okay so now we can just press Z to put 
position it to move it inside right so over here five one zero okay and then move up just like that all right over here we still need so we can say use the control v to copy and drag all right and just drag to position 510 and one more one last one copy and just drag 510 all right so for this middle panel okay maybe i can increase the size a little bit okay so just to cover up the whole all right so all the panels are done but over here okay i might need to resize and put two panels because we are we are going to put in two different types of materials so over here 460 450 let's put 4455 four, okay so just drag it here and then copy another one Control v to the right all right same goes to this side okay so over here four five five and then we can just copy and drag it to position all right so once everything is done we can just click on to the panel and select our material and there you have it so this is how to draw a custom wardrobe sliding door good luck trying guys